Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. We're here at the, the scene of the crime. Yeah, the Saws thought they were going to siege us and raise havoc. They're down to one steel mortar and a handful of themselves left, and they've already given up on this plan, and they're about to uh, to attack us directly. So I was kind of looking through these guys. There's only three that seem to be truly worrisome. That's Steiner's who character has a shooting skill of 12 and who about tater yeah shooting skill of 15 and bowman shooting skill of 13 so those three have a clue how to use a weapon as far as falling behind us as we track to get out of here and schmidt here still has a bead on rabbit you wouldn't think that'd be physically possible. I mean, the line kind of travels through this stone right here before getting to rabbit space behind the stone, but you can still see the, uh, the little, you know, he's still counting down. So, rabbit, I guess you're going north. We're kind of done here. So, our guys need to get out of here. We need to get to the, uh, uh, to the gauntlet. Handy is going to be the last one exposed to gunfire. In fact, right there, you're actually aimed, and there's no, hmm, there's no little countdown clock right there. Then you three head to here. I need to know. There's nobody in sight. What are you doing? Okay. Oh, you just started your countdown. Okay. You are still continuing your countdown. What are you guys aiming at? There's no pig in here, right? No, nothing over here. What can they possibly see? Rabbit's already leaving. There you stood down. You stood down. Okay, just a delay. All right, that means they got to start all over again to go after Handy this time. Okay, you guys are heading that way. And I'm sorry, we had Michael that was about to break. So we got to go check up on him. Oh, what's that noise? There's a sound. There it is. And that one might be an incendiary. Can't click on it. Okay, so that one's coming in. Hit all water and mud, so... But it looked differently, so I'm guessing that was an incendiary one. You guys are going to where? I guess just right into the center of it for now. And... Michael, I think it's time for you to stand down. You want to go butchering. You just needed to get into a place that looked better. Ah, beauty is crashing. Everything else is still kind of decent. Ugly environment, negative 10. That's really the, the big one right there. So, I don't have a prettier environment for you, but I can't let you stay in the gauntlet right now because you're going to... Uh, you're going to crack on me. So, that pig is armed. <laughs> okay, because we just blew up a whole bunch of our, our shelving units over here. Yeah, we got to look at these weapons. I bet you they're all really damaged. Um, tell you what, Michael, why don't you go and... There's not a thing you can do. There's no art bench left. Nothing to get you to do that will make you happier for a moment. Art, mining, in ugly environments. Uh, you kind of like growing a tiny bit. Um, cooking, okay, you get a bonus to cooking, but I'm thinking that's kind of a bloody environment, too. Down there next to the butcher area. I'm not sure what to do with you. Cathra, if I tell you to go ahead and break, you're going to clean rubble. Which will eventually make this a nicer, cleaner place for Michael. Interesting. Hmm, what do I do with that? Let's do this. Michael, let's see, let me look at the beauties. Right in there. So if we clean up all the, the mess, we still have these five pieces here with a bunch of negatives. And just a bunch of mess. In here, a bunch of mess in there too. Hmm. Compared to out here. Yeah, that's very much better. Michael, why don't you just go right here for now. And that should calm you down and keep you in the area where we need you. All right, they're coming in. So animals need to get locked away. Everything goes into the animal safe zone except
except the ones that can go in the boomalope zone. Hmm. Think about that. Um, no. Just, you know, gotta go there and get me out of everything. There. Now I'm clear. We've got lots of kibble here now. We do. Is there enough? Well, yeah, there's four stacks of 75. I guess that does need to be increased in there. I could send everybody to the boomalope zone instead of sending them into the into the uh, the base. There's something for grazers as well as, you know, the dogs and pigs. There's kibble, there's hay, there's shelter. There's not a place to sleep, but it is safe in here. And there are no more uh, um, mortars going to be logged over. Let's do that instead. Let's play with that and see what we think of of that long term as a, as a way to deal with it. All the way down there, all of you guys. So everybody head to that zone instead. All right. What else needs to be done? Not turrets. So we really just need to get these guys safely out of here. Has anybody survived? Right there. Oh, there's another one coming in. Oh, and that one looks different. That one, I'm guessing, is the, uh, uh, the... The boom boom. And missed. I think. What happened there? It's like you just saw somebody die. Your Sky. Your Pain. Your Hayden. Nobody knew just died. What? What's with that? Uh, social. Um, needs? Witness Allies Death 3. Oh, you just walked over and got closer to another one. Okay, it wasn't a result of the boom. I see. And you're insisting on repairing this. Interesting. You really want to get that done. You are Shen. And character, you can shoot... You're repairing, you have a machine pistol, and you're just going to stay back behind and get that fixed. Okay. <laughs> Any of our pigs out in here? Anybody moving around? No. You guys are over here, all the babies. They're on their way in. You guys are on your way in. They're coming in this way. We're going to get there in time, but it's going to be pretty close. All right, so who needs to man the gauntlet? Let's go this route. Alicia is right there, relaxing socially, is in great shape, has a revolver, and can shoot a little bit. So Alicia, why don't you take a, a uh, right there, a, a uh, close position in here to get a round off. But just a round. The machine pistol turning the corner could be a problem. Yeah, let's put you here until I know exactly where I want you. Miss Beep. Relaxing socially. You're going to be crashing soon. Um, you're heading for there. Let's get you a meal because you're going to break before you even get out here. So get a meal first and then hmm, consume. And I get you up in this area. How do I do that? Time you get here. Maybe if you were to clean this one, that would get you kind of in the area. Oh, let's try that again. Where are you coming from? You're all the way down there. Oh, you're a long way away. Ha! Huh. You might not get here before it's all finished. Let's rework that. You're going to go over here and do this. Then we'll try one more time. And maybe you'll be here in time. But mining takes you a long way away from everyone. Alright, Michael is over here. He's going to park himself over here. Uh, let's check your meals. Mm. I'll tell you what, instead of doing that, let's have you grab a meal and then come back. Maybe that will accomplish the same goal. If you went there and then what? Had you repair granite wall. That'll get you back over here again. And I'll see you. Natalia, where are you right now? You are out of food. You're making kibble. You're not stuck making kibble and yet you're insisting on it, not getting food. So you must be right in between a long trip of delivering kibble. So head down here and grab this. Consume a fine meal. And then... You're still good for a little while. Let's get you also up here to repair something. And that will get you walking back in this area. Kathra, you're right here. You're cleaning up this area so it's not so gloomy so that we can be in this area. And our home zone is still correct over here. So you're not going into traps to do that cleaning. Okay. Looks good. Yeah. All right. Then... 
cancel that and your meals are fine. So you just keep doing what you're doing. All right, Sangria, where are you at right now? You need food too. So you are consuming a fine meal theoretically. No, you're on your way. So when you're done with that, why don't you come up over here and clean that spot? Uh, Paradise Cleaning Dirt, Reserve Up Mississippi. Okay, then let's come over to this spot and Reserve Up Mississippi. So just do the. Boy, is that going to cancel out Mississippi's order? Then come on over here. Okay, so you do that and you'll do that. So that gets you guys all into this area. Klaus is on his way in. Shantigo. You're cooking a fine meal. How'd the meals go? You've been cooking the whole time. You're just getting our fine meals back to ready to, to finish. 50 is the cutoff point. So we didn't quite get into the prepackaged meals that I wanted. Although, they left. A whole bunch of them over here. So we got one, two, three trips of meals. We got more drugs over here to haul in and, and throw away. Or sell. Um, okay, the same ones right there. Wake up. So, Shantigo, let's draft you. You're in good shape, meal-wise, yeah. Let's draft you. Got a pistol? Hmm. Oh, all the assault rifles have been hauled away. Okay, why don't you haul one up for me, then? The dogs have been really helpful. They're not here. Where did they all go? You take them into here? No, we dropped off assault rifles to pick up snipers. I'm seeing only one. Huh. Okay. Well, why don't you head to this area as well? Head somewhere in there. And one of you two will be the first one to turn on the corner and do that. Rabbit's on his way in. Handy and Tomislav. Okay. So now we know where everybody's at. These guys need to make it in. I'm hearing my, my western music in the background with the whistling. I like this song. Very very well chosen for this part of the game. You guys are coming in fast. You are. It's got to be close. They may get to here and stop and aim and shoot us as we're just entering the doors. We have auto doors here, there, and there, but not here. Okay. Your pathway is actually down there. Instead, Tomislav, go there. Klaus, <clears throat> there. Handy. Hmm. Send all of you guys like so. You've all got snipers. I need to... Okay, you're all going in the, the best door. I need to get um, assault rifles on you. Oh, there's one there. We... No, it's the, that's the same one. We only have one here. There must be one on a pig somewhere. Because I don't see our third assault rifle. It's not there. We have a charge rifle on that one. Um, that's right. We built some of these out here. I'll bet you they automatically have our set to weapons. Yeah, I'm going to have to get in there and manually shut that down. There's a sniper on its way to deep inside the base. Thank you, dogs. Appreciate the help. Mm, yeah, these things come with the uh, weapons as default for their uh, their storage. just automatically comes with it. So we have a lost sniper or, uh, assault rifle somewhere. I don't know where it's at. There. Utah's being so helpful. Hmm. Now, if I were to just... Let's look into this. Storage, right there, you come with weapons. If I were to turn weapons off, then you come with apparel. And then if I were to... Um, copy. And then each one of these, paste, which is J. And move over a little bit. Uh, no more over here. So this one, J... J. And that's it over here. Now the medicines. Right there. J. And this one. J. Okay. I've, I set these two. I thought I set these, but I guess I didn't. If I turn all those off, will you just suddenly just drop it? Okay. Is there a chance I can get the animals? No, there isn't a chance. They're all heading for the boom up zone. Okay, so where it is, it is. So I need someone who's already down here. There is an idea to grab that and bring it up with them. But 
there is no one. There's Alicia, and there is Natalia, and there's Shantigo. Shantigo, let's do this. You are drafted. Let's equip this one, and then come on up to here. That gets the, th the third, no, the second. Okay, you're going to go to wherever it was I said you, right there. Was there one down in here? There isn't. So there's that one there. Oh, Michael's got one. And the other one is right here. Okay. That's making sense now. All right. So, Michael, what do I do with you? Because I was going to send you down to get a meal, but you've got one of the best weapons. And they're going to be here before you get back. And I kind of like you to use it. But I don't want you to break. So, getting you food really wouldn't do much. Eat a high meal plus five is right there. So it's not necessarily, it may, you know, doing this may move this a little bit over. I really just need you, hmm, gear, you've got a fine meal with you. But if I tell you to eat it, you're going to walk into there and eat it in this place. That's going to keep breaking you. I guess I just got to let you go. Go ahead and do what you were going to do. And when you get back, you get back. I'll drop you into further down, let you shoot up the length or something. Okay, so in that case, I want Klaus to hop into here and equip this one. All right, there. You're going to grab the assault rifle. Everybody else is going to come in and do other things. Um, Rabbit, who did so good down there, you're going to go straight to here. Can I do that? What's your path now? That works out well. Go right into there and shoot down the length of this with your sniper. All right. So in that case, handy. I want you to pick up a shoddy pistol. That's all we've got here, isn't it? And a normal revolver. Well, I like the pistol better. Okay, grab the revolver. So right there. And then we'll position you after that. And Tomislav, you also need to grab something. I guess you grab the shoddy pistol. Yeah. So we got to rethink this whole idea about the mortars. I thought this was a great idea, shooting through the roof in here. But it was a target that took out potentially our shells or the weapons or anybody else who was already positioned in here. It was just too much of an attraction for the enemies to lob mortar shells into. So maybe those need to be like over here. Might be a good place. Um... Could be in the middle of this, take the roof off and call this our mortar base. We could do that, give us a reason for this structure, and we can still move in around it and shoot through if we ever needed to. Yeah, I think it'd fit. I think it would fit. And we'd have a space in here somewhere for a, a closet with shelves. Maybe, yeah, I can put two shelving units right in here and pop out and over and down with a, with a, a wall and put a door at each one. That may be some way to do that. Maybe this is the new mortar um, mortar cannon uh, place. Okay, but these need to leave. And they don't uh, reinstall. They do reinstall. Oh, nice. Can we reinstall theirs if we claim them? We can claim these, right? I know, we'll get this battle going one of these days, but I'm just curious. If when they're done, if we home zone this, will we be able to claim that and then move the mortar over? Don't know. But, um, Shen, thanks for fixing it for us. I appreciate that. Anyway, time for these guys to get moving in. I've got everybody figured out where they go. And it's just a matter of what's going to happen when Tater turns the corner here. Well, he doesn't, he's got a melee. Okay. He wants to go thump him, and he can't. You guys have got guns. All right. So you're going in there. Rabbit is making the turn. Um, I was going to say, I could very quickly turn Klaus right there and get off a shot. I like that idea. I think I like that idea. Right there. Will you get there and out of there in time? I don't know. Will any of these guys stop to shoot? I don't know. All right, but you're aiming for them. Oh, that was a good one. Now, Klaus, continue grabbing the assault rifle and then jump into this space right here. You're going to be the one that shoots down the length of that. You just got what? Health? Sniper rifle to the right arm. Okay. 
Get in there, little piggy. Get in there, little piggy. Whoo, that was close. Almost made mincemeat of our little piggy. Uh-uh. <laughs> um, I could put Rabbit out to say hello, but I think he's going to get a spray of this. Um, you guys have already got your weapons. Hmm. If we still had a long range, we could pop out this door and say hi one time. But I don't think we can get there in time. Uh, Cathra, why don't you clean up right over here? Well, I guess it really doesn't matter. Anyway. Um. Would love to... Love to have someone peek around that corner. How do I do that? I think it's got to be Klaus before you grab that assault rifle. Yeah, I think so. So, Klaus, can you rush to here real quick? And if so, no. So, let's go to here there and then get to here see if there's time to do that rabbit in that case you come grab the assault rifle and then come right back to there okay and you're going to come around the corner who are you angie and bowman okay bowman is dangerous and bowman is not a man so bowman is is female pirate of the saws and a pilot at that okay alicia's there Klaus is heading around. I don't think he's going to get time to do it. He's not. Nope, he's not. Okay. Well, in that case, Rabbit, you go back. Klaus, grab the assault. And then go here. Alicia. Hmm. I don't think that's going to work for you there now. You get into this position. You've been there before, and that worked out pretty good. And who else was kind of roaming up in this direction? Um, they just haven't got here yet. Okay. And then Tomislav. What to do with you? Think about that. You and Handy, though you had assault rifles back then. But you used to stand here and shoot right through the length of this. And that worked out really well. Um, range. You can do the whole run yet with that. Okay. Tomislav, you're here. And Handy, you're here. Someone else is right there. Okay. So, Alicia, you're heading into this. And Catherine is still cleaning and making us not break here with uh, with all of the, the the really bad beauty rating in the, in the area. All right, you're heading that way. No one's doing anything crazy. Good. Rabbit, you're going to be in position real soon. Klaus went where? You're going to be in a position. You're going to drop into... Just as he turns a corner. Okay. Uh, maybe in time. Boy. You hit the trap. You're turning. Now, Rabbit's got to shoot through Klaus here. Is that a problem? I don't know. I think he's good enough not to hit him. Let's try. Okay. That's Tater. Hmm. Let's do one more. Tater's dead. Bowman is next. And started Rabbit's timer all over again. Okay. Alicia's getting a position down there. Who else is on their way up or not? Who else is out here? You guys are all filing in. That was Shen, who must have finished working on our new uh, mortar cannon. Thank you. And we have just this one left. Who's puffing out a puff of of uh, breath right there. So it must be cold out. Five degrees, and it's still the cold snap. That's right. Still the cold snap. We don't have any cowboy hats on. We do. We need to get rid of the cowboy hats. I didn't think about that. Those guys are cold. Klaus needs... Doesn't say cold, though. So you're still doing okay. The cowboy hats cool you. But I guess the jackets, the dusters, are enough to make up for it. Okay, our animals are mostly in place. There's the last little piggy that went to market. And then he came back to the boomalo grazing ground. Um, you're running in there. You're about to shoot. You have still got to start over your timer again. Um, I can't do anything with you guys till you work on this one. Cathra, let's get you needs drafted into position. And once these two leave you can take that door so you head here and maybe I'll maybe I'll peek you out 
there. But now these guys have got real fast draws, little, little machine guns. So now they're not going to put you out there. And there's nobody else that's going to surprise me later when I say I didn't know there were more people coming. Okay, good. So you're going to shoot up this length. You two are going to shoot up this length. And you two are taking this one. And there was still one or two. There's Natalia and Shantigo. You are kind of making your way up there. Okay. <clears throat> All right, let's see if Rabbit can keep from shooting Klaus and if Klaus can take out Bowman before we get to the point of Rabbit shooting. I think, Klaus, you got to leave. Go. And hit a trap. Rabbit, you're ready to shoot. And we have NG turning the corner. Boom. And you destroyed the trap. <laughs> <laughs> and that is all you're going to get out of that. So come on down and grab something that shoots faster. And there's nothing there. Hmm. What to do with you now? Come on down here, rabbit. And maybe I'll pop you, pop you back outside and head over here and shoot these guys in the back or something else like that. All right, Shantigo, you were on your way in. Okay. Where to put you? You can, yeah, that works out good right there. You guys can back up each other right there. In fact, that is the layout. It is. Klaus steps into there, and all three of you can shoot through. No, Handy steps into there. And all three of you can shoot through each other. So, Handy, you can go there right now. All right, we'll do that. Um, you guys are ready for Bowman when she turns the corner. Engie's coming. In fact, everybody's ladies left. Uh, Tater was the only guy. Steiner's is a lady. And Schmidt is as well. Um, and these two? Jenny and Shen. Yeah. <clears throat> so no guys in this group. But we still have... Boy, I've put back 20 pages. I think there's still two or three um, ladies that like to join our, our group here. Just that it's, it's really odd that almost the entire series, most of the attackers have been female. You'd think there'd be kind of a 50-50, uh, you know, random number generator going on there, but it's been really leaning toward like 80-20 this series. So if the the subscriber list was 80-20 to match it, that'd be great, but it's the opposite. It's 80-20 the other way, so that's been kind of tough. Um, you're turning the corner. Rabbit is pulling out. I wish I had an assault rifle over there, but I don't. Um, Shantigo, you're going to get in position soon. You're going to hit another trap. Bowman's probably going to be downed before we get there. So, Rabbit, you're running around to do that. Nothing more we can do here. Unless I had someone with a pistol I can run up there. And just pop off a shot and get out. But I don't at the moment. Not easily. They have to run the whole thing here to get there. Okay. So, you guys are all in place and ready to shoot. There's another trap. Boom, boom. And it's you two now. Now, everybody's done here. Rabbit, I want you to run through. And go all the way to here. I want Kethra to go there and stay there. And get ready to go to the outside. We'll see if Power Conduit. We'll see if Growing Zone. We'll see if Jenny turns around and comes back as soon as that door opens. Didn't. Okay. Now, Rabbit, you got to run through as Bowman with the machine pistol. Who could fire immediately if she chose to. Boom. Okay. One shot went off. I guess I need to watch you. Anything else I need to watch? You guys are safe. There's nobody walking out a door on me. There may be one or two that have not been, um, like Natalia, is not drafted yet. You, Pistol, what to do with you? Let's draft and set you right here. Okay. And I want to say Miss P is working her way. Well, Michael's working his way back up. Okay. Yeah, I knew that meal was going to take a long time. Oh. I thought I had told you to come oh repairing granite wall right there i saw the the components and thinking maybe he was off doing something okay so michael where let's have you back up miss uh have you back up um natalia draft you're going right here the two of you are going to shoot up this length hoping these guys can get out of there in time when that happens <laughs> and we still have a miss a piece somewhere you are cleaning building rubble Cleaning, you still didn't go for the meal. No, you're going for the meal. That's cued. Can something find meal than cleaning building rubble? Okay. I don't think you're going to get here in time. Um, let me look at that again. Miss B. Needs. 
Do you have a meal on you right now? Uh, gear. You do. If I have you eat that, and then come out this way, you could be there to meet them as they break and run. Kind of liking that idea. You eat the meal instead. Yep, that's what you're doing. And then I want you to do something out. Let's draft you. And then I can tell you to consume a fine meal. And then I can tell you to go here. And we'll just see what happens when that happens. Okay. Is that everyone accounted for? Sangria. I've not seen you. You're milking a boomalope. You kind of got missed in all this. So you're out over here somewhere. Okay, double click you. There you are. You haven't got there yet. You did get a meal. But after the meal, you didn't come up and clean or I missed that step or something. Or you did and you left and I never even saw you. So Sangria, draft you. And these guys break. Some may go this way. Some may go that way. Let's roll the dice. That some are going this way. Um, Sangria, you head to here. And guys, remind me she's there in case you know two episodes from now I finally realize that she's still standing out there. <laughs> what was the boom? Another shot came off up here. You are not shooting yet. You're igniting a standing lamp. Boom, boom. And Bowman is gone. We broke. Jenny is heading that way. Shen is heading that way. These guys are kind of all heading that way. All right, then. I want Shantigo here. 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 Okay. Tomislav, just go straight through. I don't think they will interfere with you guys. You go straight through. Klaus, um, you work your way up into there. You two, you're done. Head out this way. All the way to here. Michael, go all the way to here. What's going to happen here? Actually, Shantigo, go here. You can take care of Steiner's from a distance. Okay. Is anybody coming this direction? Doesn't look to be. So... Where do I get you guys to not shoot the rest of them in the back? <laughs> um, Jenny's down and dead. Okay. Hmm. I think we're we're overgunned here. Why don't you guys break and go ahead and do what you need to do? And while that break is happening, let's really quickly queue up. Uh, Rosalina got up and is fleeing. At one, uh, you know, one an hour, <laughs> at a speed of one, but is going to be off the map beforehand, and there's nobody else to come out here and get. Okay, there is a lot of stuff to come and collect, but we'll worry about that at the end of this episode, because I am 35 or so minutes into this. 34, 33? Don't know. My timer says 34, but I've took a minute to get started, and I've got a 30 second intro into the series, so I never know exactly what time you've got compared to what time I've got. Um, we're right there. You guys are kind of waiting for someone to peek their head out who's thinking, oh man, I'm not sticking my head out there. Shantika's going to shoot this way. Um, rabbit. Release. Go relax socially over there in that dirty place. Okay. Because nobody's heading this direction. Miss a P, you were thinking about it after... Did you actually eat? No. So let's release you and now consume and then go ahead and do whatever you like. And I think that takes care of most everybody but Natalia. Go ahead and release you. You're going to go to bed where you need to be. It's one in the afternoon. And I guess let's see who turns the corner. Boom. Schmidt just got a mouth full or a face full. Michael, what are we going to do with you? You're going to go right there. Down, headshot, down, boom. We have Schmidt. What kind of headshot? Tell me it's not a brain. Head, gunshot. Spine, gunshot. Otherwise, possible. Okay. I mean, really big trouble here from being shot up. We have Shantigo taking out the last one. 
over here. Okay, well, Schmidt was a... No, I'm thinking of Steiner's. Schmidt, um, character, was not the great shot. Okay. But is capable of dumb labor. So can haul, can clean, can art, can cook, can animal a little bit, wants to learn how to grow. Looks like a keeper to me. Okay. Um, yeah. Michael, let's do that. Butchering, no, you're going to capture Schmidt. And Natalia, no, Tomislav. You are going to be ready to go down there and and uh, heal. All right, so Shantigo is walking through here, or, or shooting through here at Steiner's. Who is the one that had the good um, shooting and has bloodlust? And very pretty. So it could be interesting as well. Can we wound Steiner's instead of kill Steiner's? Who could be meleeed? Could be. Kathra. Uh, character, four. Steiner, six. Klaus, eight. Chantigo, stand down. Go, go, go find meal. Klaus, um, go here. <clears throat> Kathra, go here. I don't know if these last rounds of bullets are going to kill Steiner's, but I'm going to at least get you guys in position. Six. Handy, four. Handy, you come over here too. While they're moving, they won't automatically shoot. Okay, Steiner's so far needs health. It's in great shape. Left arm and right arm though should take out some of the, the fight. Okay, and I'm gonna do that. Okay, Klaus, you get the best. I want you to melee attack uh boy if i could just find a way to get you guys not to automatically shoot how do i do that because it's just going to be klaus and the rest of you are going to want to shoot right there yeah you're you're ready to okay if i were to tell you to melee and tell you to melee that way you guys wouldn't use your your weapons tomislav and shantigo are not set to use their weapons Okay, that's working, and they all three have access. We didn't have that before. Down in here, there was just the one, you know, fighting whoever was over there, and there was just no way to get the three of them into help. Klaus took a punch to the what? Um, hypothermia and shivering. Interesting. I checked for cold over here. didn't get it. Why is it not a negative for being very cold when there's hypothermia setting in? Hmm. Anyway. Uh, what was the damage? It was bruised to the torso. Okay. Boom, boom. Now you're going after Cathra and Mist. And Klaus and Steiner's is probably getting lots and lots of bruises. Okay. We did get the one picked up over here. Yeah. And Michael was carrying and should be getting down there pretty soon. Okay. Come on. Take down. Killed. Guys. Just, you know... Break her leg or something. What is this? She had to snap her neck or jaw or something. Okay, well, that's done. Okay. Otherwise, we had Natalia walking by blood. Okay. We've got Ugg over here and Gecko. I'm looking for a Michael. Was Michael, right? Yeah, you're down over here now. So that is the only um, survivor of the attack, except for the one that got away over here and is gone. Um, yeah, I can't think of the name now. All right, well, is anybody else still drafted? Nobody else over here is. Um, and there'd be nobody else anywhere else. We already got Mr. P and, my, and Rabbit. Okay, so everybody is not drafted anymore. And... Tomislav is relaxing socially over there. I need to get him down here. How do I do that? Let's get him to clean that one pile of dirt. And then he can relax socially right in here and be ready. Break risk, Mississippi, who needs to go to bed. Needs 
Yeah. So she's doing that. And she'll be fine. Okay. So that will get Tomislav down here to be able to uh, treat both our, enemy, our, our prisoner and Klaus, who is Klaus. Why are you going here? Relaxing socially at this place? Campfire. Bills. Add bill. Okay. Thought there was a way to tell a campfire to not be a gathering spot. But I want it to be a gathering spot for these guys, but apparently it's a gathering spot for our guys. Because Klaus seems to be going there to relax socially. Which is interesting. He'll be there to uh, talk with these guys and, and make sure they actually got food. They did. Yeah, well, this one is sleeping, but we'll be getting food in a moment. Okay. So we are around 40 minutes into this. Let's do some cleanup type activities. First of all, grab all the bodies and unforbid and strip. All the ones that are in here are on the other sides of tripped traps. So there's no chance of having missed a trap and left it set for our people to walk into and you know, not good things happen to. Otherwise, let's get all of, let's see, I want X, I want F, forbid. All of those, those, any more weapons in here, snipers. Okay, that's fine. And I will leave Flake and the other one forbidden until I'm ready to haul them in and then get them forbidden again. So that is the end of here, except for that. Everything else is unforbidden here. Okay, over in here, let's get all this stuff unforbidden. So, bodies, unforbid, and strip, meals, shells, and steel, those, there's a bolt action, any more little X's? Yeah, silver, 111. Okay. Interesting, 111. I saw someone with 71. So did, did silver get dropped over here? No. So whoever was over here didn't have the silver in their pockets. So the one that got away must have been the one with the 71 silver that I think I saw in one of their inventories. Okay. We still have that drug there. It's going to uh, stay forbidden. Did they make that or did we? Have we had any reason to ever build that? I don't think so. They did build sandbag walls, like I'm used to. I'll bet you everywhere that was pre-programmed for them to build it was either over the top of mud or water, and so it skipped it all. That might be what happened there, because I always see them building sandbags around a siege. Got to protect themselves. Okay, so with that going, let's quickly set home zone to out in here in case that helps to get everything collected. And then, there's a raccoon over there. We'll get the granite in as well, right there. Um, that is everything that was theirs, correct? And just to make sure that that actually happens, let's go ahead and put those guys back into the home zone. And that right there, and that up there, and that up there. Okay, I want all the stuff hauled in. Whether that makes a difference or not, I don't know. And let's get the wild boar area back into up in here. Right there, and through here. Alicia's up there. She's going to go do some mining. Okay, there, there, and over in here, and yeah, up in there as well. Okay, so that is all of the goodies in this area for the wild boars to work their way up into. All right, so with that, can I just kind of let everybody go? I think so. We only have the one prisoner coming in. Klaus needs to be treated. Kethra is going to clean dirt over here. Handy is going to start doing all the repairs. Temperature in here is over on that side, 64 and holding. And um, Alicia digging at. That's right. You're the one that I so desperately need to be over here stripping bodies for us. So sorry about that. I know that was a long walk out there, but I need you to go on to haul duty, take your mining down and to pop down over here and you're already over here you really are okay 
Do this one. That one. That one. Needs. Hmm. Then I want you to eat a prepackaged meal because we have one too many to haul back. I'm pretty sure. Um, let me zoom in a little bit. Actually, if I had you do one of the other ones instead, that would be better. Um, let's do that again. Alicia, let's have you first eat. Let's do it that way. One of these. Um, right there. And then you're going to start stripping bodies. Okay. You're going to do those. We have, we have components to also unforbid. Okay. So, Alicia, then, now that you're mealed up, you should be able to do every one of them without breaking. So you're going to head over here and strip Bowman. It looks like there's two right there, but that's a chunk underneath. And Steiners. And up in here, we've got Jenny. We've got Tater. And we've got NG. Is that all of them? I think so. So that's your job for a while. And that gets the most important things going without pause. Okay. Down here, we have a body coming in. All right, we have a prisoner coming in. Okay, let's put it that way. You are Schmidt, and it is darn cold in here. It's 75 degrees. That's a leftover from being in the cold out there. <laughs> Some programming that's still attached to Schmidt's script there says, it's cold in here. Um, Schmidt, prisoner, 92%. Let's assume we're going to recruit you. Klaus, you are relaxing socially. Needs, out of curiosity, before I go back to... You only have a bruise. So you're fine. You really don't need to be... Uh, in fact, why are you here, though? Why didn't you go straight to a bed? Needs, because your joy is so bad, it was overriding everything. Is that what I'm getting out of that? Your schedule, Klaus, right there. You're one on bed rest and one on patient. Okay. But it didn't trigger you to go to this hospital bed which has not been claimed by anybody else you instead needed your your social or your uh, your beauty here whatever it is social what do you call it i lost it work no needs klaus needs joy that's the word i couldn't find all right so schmidt character female cult child jailbird incapable of caring social and intellect it's a nudist to match Ugg, who's also a nudist. Hmm. It's going to get really interesting soon. <laughs> Nervous chemical interest. Health is not on anything. Good. Has a spine gunshot. Has a head gunshot, but not a permanent injury to either. <clears throat> Gets blue medicine because we want to potentially... Um, um, I was going to say draft. Um, recruit you. Okay. Character can cook, can art, wants to grow, wants to handle, has a passion for shooting. Okay. I'd say yes. You're a keeper. You are deep talk with Jenny Shen Bowman Tater. No big negatives there. Needs. My rival Hayden has died. My rival Bowman has died. But my friend Jenny died. Constraining clothes, observed corpse, witness allies death four times, experiencing acute pain. Okay. So, Tomislav, let's get you immediately, if you aren't already. You know, you're on joy right now. So let's get you into tending mode and dive into there. And Michael's on his way to playing chess. Everybody needs a break. Everyone needs some joy right now. They're all on the verge. So Klaus is relaxing socially and hopefully we'll have a conversation. Don't know if he will with people from jail. Maybe that is only a recruit uh, aspect, not just a normal standing around thing that's going to happen. Okay. Hopefully these guys are content enough that they're not going to jailbreak. But the one time we did have a jailbreak, the mood wasn't far from here. So it wasn't you know, if it was the mood was down in here, I would understand it. But it was it was right in here? It was in good shape. So I didn't understand. Mood didn't seem to be a determiner of it. It was more of just a randomness. Schmidt, health, eighty-seven percent quality, uh, 
100% quality. Boom. All these just came in. 95% quality. We're looking pretty good. That's torso and or head and spine looking great. One last one right there. What happened? Oh, that's old and frostbite scar. Okay. So Thomas was grabbing a meal. He's going to feed Schmidt. And Klaus is eventually going to start talking to these guys. Relaxing socially. Needs. Eventually. Oh, you just triggered. Now you're going to go to sleep. <laughs> because it's, you know, uh, where is it? Four in the afternoon. Hmm. Okay. Oh, you're going to go get healed. Ah, I see. In that case, health, let's just take your medicine off. Okay. All right. So that's good. And I think we're good. I'm going to go through and try to round up and clean up and put... You know, get more graves dug and get places for bodies and, and get the animals to haul all this stuff in and send some folks up here to, to grab all of this stuff and get the, the drugs put away and locked down and all that sort of thing. So, and also before we leave though, can I claim I can? Right there, reinstall that. Okay, we have a third mortar. So that's probably one of the next things to do is to figure out just what's going to happen to the mortars. Can I get three in there? I might be able to put one there, one down in there, and one up here. And soon, before I would guess the next siege would come in, if we don't just randomly draw a second one in a row, whoever's got bedrooms right here by then will be in here. So if that is a true target of a siege, there won't be anything here but a greenhouse. Okay. I think that's a plan for later. Let me know what you guys think if there's a problem with that plan. I don't think there is. So with that, yeah, let's call this one done. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.